Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Immerse. Welcome back to the channel if you are a returning subscriber. Um, I know it's been a minute since I have posted. I tried to play Bottle Warfare. I tried to play it as much as I could, but it wasn't really a fun game and it got boring very, very quickly. So first things first, um, yeah, it's been a minute since I've posted. So something quick I do want to say before the video, um, I'm going to show you all of my settings right now, but after the settings, I have this little clip. It's like a little short clip about how the audio on siege works and stuff like that so even if you do just copy down my settings or whatever and you don't know how sound works in siege i highly suggest you should watch the entire video go watch the clip or just skip to the clip after you get the settings it doesn't really matter just go watch that clip of me explaining how sound works in siege and under try and understand that to the best of your ability because that is see audio and siege is the most important thing you could have on the game i don't see a lot of videos on audio settings on siege well and that's kind of strange to me because audio on this game is like the most important thing you could have in a game like siege audio if you can ask anyone audio is so important hearing anything in siege will literally give you the upper hand so yeah here are the settings right here um it um for dialogue and music i put mine very very low because i kind of like the music that it has so i um i like to have it in the background dialogue you can have this anywhere between 20 and 40 mine's perfect middle of the 30. um master volume is literally the audio for everything in the game so you're gonna want to put that on 100 and um voice chat i put mine on 90 it's usually anywhere between 80 to 90. um but yeah those are the audio settings now i left dynamic range for last because that is the most important thing that um anyone really talks about on siege like oh what's your dynamic range and then that's it they don't really care about all this other stuff but like all this is really just a preference to you i mean i usually these two things must they're like a must they must be under 50. um this is like anywhere between 70 and 90. um but yeah, master volume should always be on 100. Now, the three things you can either choose are night mode, TV, and hi-fi. Now, I'm gonna rank these in one to being the best and three being the worst. Now, night mode is the best. If you're not playing on night mode, I don't know what you're doing. It enhances like all the little things, like breaking, like barricades breaking, um, EMPs being thrown, and just stuff like that. And it minimizes like the dialogue the gunshots that you can hear so yeah that is why night mode is the best now tv it's literally just everything on tv every single thing like in every single audio in the game is literally the same there's no difference between anything it's nothing louder or higher and there's not really like a a very good way to hear on tv at all so that's probably the worst so night mode being the best tv being the worst and hi-fi so hi-fi is just like a worser version of night mode it kind of does the opposite of night mode it like it enhances the wrong things that you want to hear so it enhances like gunshots and like people talking in the background or whatever like dialogue so um that is why hi-fi is like kind of like the opposite of night mode but so yeah that is why these are the best settings now so say you're in this hallway say you're in white hallway and you hear someone drop down hatch if they're dropping down hatch what's gonna happen is the sound that they make either like explosions or whatever um, it's gonna travel around corner so what it's gonna do is it's gonna come all the way through here and you will still be able to hear it. it's gonna like so sound works in siege is it travels around corner so say you're looking this way and you hear something behind you and, and it you don't see anything it's probably because they're down on red and they're still making noise or whatever but since sound literally does travels around doors like this and spreads that is how sound works in siege so yeah this is a really quick thing um i really just wanted to show you how sound works in siege so people can understand like where the sounds are coming from and where people are in the game so if this really did help um let me know in the comments if this if this short little thing helped i hope everyone enjoyed the video and um let's get a like for year five rainbow six siege um i hope it's gonna be a good year and get some good seasons so yeah if you guys want to subscribe and like even though probably none of you are watching right now so i'm just gonna end the video